Hello everybody. Guess what day it is? Fresh Crack Friday. So, what are we gonna open today? Oh, hey. Barrel aged toasted marshmallow. <laughs> Whatever. I'm gonna let you guys pick. So, you see the bottles on the shelves. And which one should we pick out? Comment below. Let's see what you got. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. This way? This one? Over here? Over this way? This way? No. Oh, this isn't a live stream. What the hell are you guys thinking? Here. There we go. <laughs> Dang. Camera lady's getting edgy with me. <laughs> Look at that. I think I'm gonna need a knife. <laughs> Son of a biscuit. I tell ya. Child proof, adult proof. I don't know. Whatever. It is what it is. It's open. That's all that matters. It's got some funky wax stuff on it. So anyway. What are we going to be opening today? I'm Michael, by the way, and this is Beach Sand Bourbon. Thanks for joining me. It's been one of those weeks. Finally stopped snowing after eight and a half feet. I don't know, 10 feet, 20 feet. It's all snow. Doesn't matter. It rained all week, almost. Got rid of a lot of snow, which is a bonus. I hate snow. Knob Creek 9. Hunter Proofer, Kentucky Straight Bourbon. So, need a crowbar to get that thing open. Holy smokes. Yeah, so you guys thought I was having a live stream here, <clears throat> but I wasn't, I wish I was. But I just wanna say thank you to all the new subscribers I got a Bolt load. And I got a lot of help from a lot of other whiskey tube creators. I just want to say thank you to you guys especially. So you helped me kind of get up over that little hump, get going, move things along, make things better, doing some progress. So cheers to the camera lady over there. She finally got some smiles on her face. <laughs> She just tells me I'm number one all the time. She's my favorite. So, Knob Creek 9. Halfway to 18, in case you didn't know. Maybe you didn't do the math. I don't know. Getting some nice vanillas out of that one. Some leather. A little bit of leather. No, that's not the cat's collar. That's the boss. She has a old fashioned over there. You have to take her out on a special date night tomorrow. Look at that. And that's a real smile there. <clears throat> so I'm getting some oak on the on the nose. A little bit of caramel. Maybe some maple. No, not maple. Something sweet on the nose. Almost a fruity cherry note. On the nose, on the palate. Get a little bit of that lingering, a little bit of a cherry on there, almost a fruity, a fruity note. Still get that cherry on the nose. If anybody else gets a cherry on the nose on Knob Creek 9. But I like it. I do. A lot of oak on the 
palette. 100 proofer. Get that little bit of burn in the back and the finish. A little bit of a sweet on the end of it. Maybe a, some type of a sugary note. Anyway, some things we got coming up. When we hit that 500 mark, that's our next goal. <clears throat> our first goal was 100. We kind of hit 100, moving on. Next goal, 500. At 500, we're gonna try to do something special for some people. We're gonna to, uh, have some kind of a contest or something. But I do have a question. I do have some homework for all of you. And my question is, why is this allocated? Is it allocated in your area? Because apparently in Michigan, where I'm at, this bottle, some people only see five bottles a year. So I'm just wondering, is it allocated in Michigan only? Or is it allocated or not allocated in your area. So let me know in the comments. I'm gonna put you to work, let you do a little homework, come up with some answers for me. Because my beautiful bride decided to finish off my last bottle. And my oldest son, Jordan, who is basically my big time bourbon hunter, goes around looking for this bottle and finds out that hey <laughs> I don't know why you're looking for that I only get five a year five cases no five bottles so why is the very old Barton allocated in Michigan or is it allocated everywhere so that's your homework comment below Make sure you like, subscribe, and share this with your buddies, friends, everybody else. Tonight, Knob Creek 9. Look at that. I was going to slam the top down, and the bottle top popped out. So, have yourself a great night. We will see you soon for some more fun. But hey, by the way, that is barrel age, so that does qualify kind of as bourbon, right? Bourbon barrel? No? <laughs> the boss, boss said no. Not happening, she said. Anyway, have yourself a great night. We will see you soon.